Eamon Murphy is my name. I've been farming here on this family farm since the early 80s. Uh, my father farmed here since the early 50s when he bought this farm. It was always a dairy farm. We farmed up to 90 cows until quarters came in. Uh, that was what a, a stop and everything for 30 years. Then we had to, when that was up 2015, then we expanded. Uh, we put in plans for a new milking parlour, new roadways, uh, new bull tank. We milked 150 cows last year. Next year we hope to go to oh, well over 200. Uh, one of the things now with uh, expansion is the need for hot water because the, the thing out there now is uh, hygiene and cleanliness and milk quality. And one of the ways that you ha will uh, have milk quality is hot water. I invested in a dairy geyser a year ago. Uh, from the day one, quality improved and it's dead up at the top notch. Uh, I'm happy with it. The co-op is happy with it. Uh, and I recommend it to anyone that's uh, getting into dairy and or expanding to uh, consider seriously a dairy geyser. This is the dairy geyser here that I mentioned earlier. As you can see, it's quite easy to install. Cold water in, hot water out, boiling water all the time. Uh, I have no fear going from a chlorine-based detergent to a non-chlorine-based detergent um, because at the end of the day, if it's non-chlorine-based detergent, there'd be no fear of the chlorine showing up in the end product.